Hello and welcome from the Karschak studio here in Germany. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> in case Roger would ever see this, uh, Roger, he did what I usually do. <laughs> Then you would know. That's another topic. <laughs> hey, today it's a it's a very interesting uh, two actually two interesting points. Yeah. One was wait, there is something in the screen. Is this visible? I think it's not visible for yeah, but it's, it's, it's confusing. for you annoying. Okay. Uh, the idea was the following last week, and if you have not seen it, sorry, go back watch it uh, after this stream certainly. We announced the new uh, the five newest effects that we will release. Um, due to my uh, circumstances that I was out of order more or less for three months, um, we were not able to uh, release new effects and we have five in the pipeline right now. And uh, actually you were able to vote. And, so cool. Uh, absolutely. So and this, let's see if this works. Yeah. Uh, yes, you voted and because we asked you to uh, go to a certain page where you can uh, place your, your vote for the, the, the effect that you want to see first. And uh, here's the result. Yeah, but before. Oh, yes, before do this. We show you this. Bada bang, bada boom. And here we are. Sorry, you, we are. you see, I'm so excited uh, that I wanted to continue. Um, yes, you, you placed your vote here. We have uh, over 250, 200. Yeah, I, yeah. Actually, I, I thank you so exactly. much for helping. Uh, yeah, and it's so much fun to know what to find out what you prefer to see first yeah. and what is your favorite trick. And actually, it was my secret favorite, yeah. favorite as well. I, I would awesome have, life. I would have place the other ranks a little bit different yeah, yeah but this one was uh, awesome and so cool do you think uh, there is another magic store He, they do it like us and build with the community together <laughs> which release come first <laughs> no <huh>? no <laughs> yes. certainly also a creator would not wait to release five tricks on one, at one time so he would just release yeah. whenever he can exactly yes. but we show you now uh, the results please yes Germany, 12 points. <laughs> That's Euro, Eurovision Song Contest. Let's, let's do that. Um, uh, the first and uh, most vote votings went to Blank Thoughts. It's an awesome routine. Uh, Philo showed it. You, if, you, if you don't know what we are talking about, please uh, go back to our last uh, stream that we did last Monday, um, where we showed all five tricks. And uh, so you said uh, what, with which effect should be the first and it will be blank thoughts promised it will be released this month together with uh, the second uh, place and this is wild dice great routine it's it's a classic by mark leverage yes uh, also um, visible here uh, either on youtube because it was filmed by lll publishing it's on one of the dvds of mark leverage first draw jack <laughs> front row front jack. row jack front oh row my jack, gosh yes. <laughs> I, I, I really hope that I can find the poster that I got uh, back then with all the signatures yeah. of these guys uh, because at Magic Life there was one time uh, was where three guys from the audience uh, who visited the LNL publishing um, store there and it was awesome the cool thing is um, we we release all of them but now we have yeah we have a in, this, in this particular order because yeah. Uh, every trick needs specific uh, work, I mean with trailers, artwork, packaging and so on and so on. And there's a timetable, Christian. Uh, yeah, I, co I committed that we will release two of the effects. The first ones that we announced, Blank Thoughts and uh, Wild Dice will be released in uh, May. Yeah. And uh, don't ask in a week. No, that's not possible. No, but uh, <laughs> Blank Thoughts we will filming on this, this week right now. I will film... Yes, one part yes, 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 uh, on yes, Wednesday, yes. no, on, on Thursday. I think uh, when you will do this together with uh, Mark, the Wild Dice, yeah. uh, this because we will certainly include the performance and the instructions of uh, Mark Leverage as the classic version, yeah, because yeah. it's, uh, is it VHS? I think, no, I, I mean, it was filmed on DVD, but certainly we are now on a higher level. And yeah, due to COVID, um, we cannot get him to another studio where we would film him. 
Um, then position number three and all these other three effects, I hope that I can release them or that we can release them in June, so next month. And this would be pl uh, uh, place number three is espionage point blank. Yeah, I was feeling this one will the second place. So that will that would gain the second place. Yeah. yeah. That was my feeling. So and, was and imagine, imagine. I'm, okay, we have a very small monitor here, so yeah. we have to go a little bit closer. So there's a huge difference between the. I mean, very, very close. Uh, it's a head, uh, head to head uh, race with blank thoughts and wild dice. Yeah. Um, at the beginning of the voting, blank thoughts was way stronger. Mm, yeah. And got a little bit weaker. I think really wild dice is an awesome routine. It is. Now, um, I wouldn't say that. Espionage point blank is so weak. It's just that the other two tricks are really strong. So this will be the next one together with uh, the um, uh, Visa Versa and the Invisible Date. Everything is here. We are preparing the decks right now. So we are preparing the first blank thought decks uh, right now. I did all the instructions to, uh, for the preparation uh, today with my employee so that she can uh, start immediately. And uh, yeah, we are really excited that this will be uh, in your hands in a couple of weeks. So that's uh, our voting that you did. And so thank great. you so much for the particip uh, participation. Yeah, so How cool. We, um, so cool. Do I click it again? Yeah. Yes, and there it is gone. And don't forget, um, subscribe and uh, ring the bell. So for helping us to grow a little bit more in the Card Shark International. So step by step, you put in the other English videos in this channel, I think it was. No, uh, the, uh, because we, we started our uh, live streaming on the Card Shark Journey, uh, Germany YouTube channel and then thought that it might be better to um, separate the German streams from the English streams. So we started a new channel. You are right now on this English channel. This only has a couple of videos, but they are missing in the other one in case people who have subscribed in the English in, in the German one uh, would now miss the English streams. So we wanted to copy them over there. Not that easy. It took me one day and Mark to solve it because I tried really to add them into the uh, into the uh, what are they called these uh, these groups uh, playlist and it did not work and um, it's seemingly a bug of YouTube we solved it uh, thanks to Mark and uh, so everything is working now but so that you will not miss the next uh, YouTube stream from us in English um, it would be awesome if you would just subscribe uh, leave a like uh, click the bell and so write a comment when you have something oh write down uh, below uh, in the comments uh, whatever definitely. you want yes so yeah, yeah it helps us we will we will see it definitely answer everything um, we read every single comment and uh, all the guys the bots that are leaving uh, sex links etc <laughs> we are reading them as well yeah but and, and certainly I'll delete them <laughs> <laughs> okay. Strange algorithm. He, he, reads, just, he just, reads everything. It's just so weird. Yeah. I mean, it's just two minutes yeah, after yeah, the yeah. stream, boom, 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 come the first comments, yeah. and we have to delete them and all. And then you have a virus on your on your. Uh, no, 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 no. They are just there. Hey, They're we we there. also uh, streaming today the first time from our new streaming uh, PC PC. Yes, but Computer? we are, but we are streaming the second time yeah. with, without Mark. Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. Right. One time he was already missing, yeah. and something didn't didn't work immediately. Yeah, but today it was okay. He he, he yeah. leaves when we start, so the second one. Yes, and yes, and and he set up everything. He so is so great. So thank you so much uh, for helping us and for being in the Kachak team. So on the other hand, we can now say everything because I guess that right now during driving back to his home, he's he's on. Twitch yeah, like. in, his, in his own <laughs> channel, so it doesn't yeah. matter. <laughs> no, anyhow, today is a very interesting topic, um, and I hope I can get some structure in it because I certainly get mm, most mostly uh, every day a request for custom printed cards. Yeah, and, and we will, we will. I think we have a lot of questions in the German stream. I think we can put this question also 
In the they, English they, one. they were all going in the in in the same direction, yes. And and as far as long as I'm staying halfway in the queue, I think we have them. That's cool. And if you remember them, just throw them uh, to me. I and remember everything. Damn it, Mark <laughs> is here. <laughs> He's not streaming. <laughs> English, please, uh, Mark. English. <laughs> thank you again, Mark. Uh, we we do a little support for you because uh, we love you and we are so happy that uh, that you are here in uh, the Kachak team. So. That yes, but please, I, <laughs> ice on the street. I don't want you to have an accident. Yeah, we, we need you. We yes. need you. No, yes. no, we we don't need you. We need your. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Talking about custom playing cards. Custom playing cards. Um, let me see if this works or not. I, I can't. I can't wait when you because the next project, big project, is uh, Mark's deck. And I can't wait to get this beauties in my hands. So. Okay, now, okay, we have to talk about this again. You <laughs> certainly can get also your custom printed yeah. decks yeah. in a single qu uh, quantity that you only have, let's say, one um, job for a customer and want to get it branded. We can print this. Later, I can explain more to this uh, about this. But you certainly can have also your complete deck printed in a higher quantity. Um, the minimum quantity please don't expect that you can already print let's say 100 or 200 decks this is not possible no printer will like to do this well there's a certain certain possibility to but make it you don't want to pay them yeah it's, okay it's, it's I, because I, I it's only one thing i think it's very interesting yeah. for the community i heard about it that uh, some a friend of mine he printed his cards directly i think uh, in katamundi yeah. but 200 or 250 decks so, mm -hmm. do you think that makes sense, or is I it printed already this kind of quantity? I know the price; it's super high. In case you would never ever perform more than 200, 250 times, then maybe you want to invest it. Well, I th I think it's extremely expensive. Yeah, yeah. I uh, it's it's a it's a it's a big difference between when we when you produce two thousand five hundred decks and oh, it's it's uh, okay. about a fifth of the price. Yeah. Or let, let's say a, a fourth. Okay. So okay. it's it's four times more expensive if you go for a small quantity, because setting up the whole machine, uh, doing the, all the all the setup, um, it's it's really high. So um, I can get cards printed starting with 500 decks. What usually no printer does. But you can I, do this because you are very because long. I'm printing because I'm printing more with them and, and you are Karchak. Yes, and, and so they <laughs> okay, so. they are okay that from time to time they are printing just 500 decks and uh, otherwise we would start with a thousand. Best would be two and a half thousand and up. Certainly, that's a number that is uh, frightening. That uh, that that killed me also when I started being Karchak. I was uh, when when I contacted US Playing Card the very first time and they told me two and a half thousand decks. It's like never ever possible with packet tricks so my very first job at the print at the german playing card manufacturer was 400 decks wow yes and that was uh, um the the uh, s a company owned by carter mundi but uh, mm -hmm. run in in germany the quality was terrible i, I th there was also the phoenix uh, phoenix cards mm, no it was high sickle Ah, that, was that, that was Heisiger. But the yeah. first run after Heisiger was the Phoenix. It was the first no, Phoenix then, run. No, then came Heisiger DOS uh, two. Okay, and then <sighs> because a while. I, Fe I, Phoenix started in two thousand nine, but I printed already in. I get one of the, of the old six. ones in my hands because I find it in, in my boxes at home, and mm -hmm. that was so terrible, Christian. There's the, the, no the way to do a Pharaoh shuffle with no, this. No, no, this. no, 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 no. They don't even fan. No, no, they, no. yeah, exactly. But, but, but the German, the, the printer said, that's exactly the quality of the scarf players. Who, they want it like this. They, they don't fan at all. It's, it's okay. terrible. So. Uh, it's linen structure. Um, cards are great. It's more or less the same um, playing card stock that I'm using also in Taiwan. However, the finish that was available in Germany at the time, not out of discussion. So I did one job, no, actually two for Packetrix, and then never again. That was okay. uh, not the well. Cool. I did the, the the vintage cards with them oh, okay. because I thought uh, for vintage cards, if they look like 100 years old, they don't have to fan anyhow, exactly. and it would look Makes strange sense. if you if you have very old, old uh, worn out cards. And you, you would be able to do a nice pen. It, it doesn't make sense. So when you are interested about uh, cards, you own create your own deck, then write us an email, and Christian uh, can help you and. 
Yes. Can so, tell you everything what you need. And, and certainly there are a lot of options. I will show you a few today. Um, and you should just contact me so that we can figure out what exactly you want because as there are so many variations, I would like to find the best solution for you. And starting with 500 decks, that's the minimum. I would suggest uh, a thousand. Um, with a thousand, we can still print it in Taiwan and I think the price will be still very, very good. It's also then possible to go to Katamundi and to a US playing card. However, the, the, these are all printers in case you have never heard of those. Um, however, the price for a thousand decks is still very high. I mean, they are charging just for the card case over one dollar more. Just instead of having an, a, a white unprinted card case, printing this one is a dollar more per deck. Yeah, it is. It's, it's amazingly expensive. So I would never ever do this. I, okay. I even did the first jobs that I where I printed the decks, took the white card cases and produced my own card cases here in Germany yeah. so that the customer then would be able to... Uh, many of it was half the price of the box. That's also a good thing because you produce for me, you, you remember, for me only the card boxes. So yes. because I yes. use the Phoenix cards and then I have my own card boxes and I, yeah, I change only the, the cards from the old box to my boxes. And the quality was so great yeah. and it was cheap. It was not expensive. Absolutely. Now let me check something. I hear just right now that the picture is unsharp. Is this still unsharp? The background, certainly it makes sense that it's unsharp, but what about our faces? It looks good. In case you are still seeing an unsharp picture, um, then uh, please refresh your browser. You might have some problems there with the, with the caching. Might be. Now, um, yeah, in, in, in some cases, uh, magicians want to have their own decks but cannot afford the quantity and uh, the idea is that um, that we can offer the standard phoenix deck however prepare a custom printed card case uh, with your own logo in in the design of phoenix so that you can put the phoenix decks uh, in inside and have your branded okay. deck of cards to give away we are we are fine philo yeah yes we are all fine okay so uh, this can happen, we can do this, and this is also an option to uh, brand something for you for a reasonable price, a lower quantity, etc. Um, that, that's fine. Now, if you really want to have um, uh, yeah, business You always classes, look sharp. I know. <laughs> yes. I may adjust the quality of the stream. Ah, okay. So uh, let's do the top view. I would like to show you yeah, some of the cards we'll on the and top. let's see if that. we can do nope. it. Okay, you don't want like to. It. Okay, so uh, let me show you some of the cards. Certainly here we have the 52 cards on one uh, uh, print. That could be a, a trick card. It could be something like, let's see, like something like this with a misindex uh, uh, image or uh, a double facer gimmick. All this is possible certainly we are we are designing this for you uh, but then it could also be advertisement cards uh, or business cards like this or that and I like to include some um, information into the cards what I did already with my cards that this. Um, even this is uh, it looks like a normal deck of cards um, or an, a normal bag however it is uh, there's a QR card a QR, QR code hidden in the in the back design here's the same that i also added the uh, the, the qr code however there are even cooler ways and uh, that's when i did it with titanus there's also a good question uh, alex uh, two questions uh, in case yes so uh, maybe you can answer them uh, i know the wrong topic <laughs> i will send you my own designs for the cards in what format should they be um it, it depends. If you have already done them, um, I would prefer to see one card, one face, one back, whatsoever. And uh, usually people send them in PDF files or I'm designing everything in CorelDRAW. So if you, can, uh, if, if you want to stay in CorelDRAW, you can send me this and we go from there. So yeah. that's all possible. Right, right on an email or Christian uh, uh, info uh, at yeah. card. Yeah. You know, card-sharp.de exactly so um, while these cards here have QR codes uh, printed on they don't have to be it could be a normal back design like this what is not possible I forgot to tell this 
uh, we cannot print a business card or an advertisement card etc with a bicycle bag this is out of question us playing card is not allowing this um, because weird weird uh, uh, um, explanation however when you are having uh, a bicycle deck then the copyright information is written on the bottom mm. if you only have a single card outside of a card case mm. there are no information about the copyright and therefore they prefer only to have the f it's it's weird that's why all all the gimmick cards are printed on mandolins that's More why less, yes yeah. uh, the, the whole the, the whole copyright process the whole copyright problem um, is giving the, uh, the, the the necessity that all the gimmicks etc most of them are okay. printed Th on Mandarin then I have or, one or question made. yes because I know our products and I love the gaff deck mm -hmm. but there is something in the gaff deck mm -hmm. who is very special because there is a gaff card it calls double back on double back bicycle on the one, one side, side and on the other side phoenix yes what do you think about this uh, great because yeah. I, uh, because i printed it yeah and it's allowed <laughs> for you yes sure otherwise they would not have printed it um <laughs> it is possible as long as the back design uh, well there is no advertisement on it and no business card it's just oh. a playing card so in case you have let's say a misindexed oh. face on a regular back all fine. If you have um, a marked back or a misprinted back, etc., no way of getting it in bicycle. Mm. I found one of the cards in here, but that's a very old printing job. Uh, it doesn't say exactly which year it was. However, I found a card. Look at this one here. Is it allowed? Not anymore. It would not be anymore. So yeah, it's back then, these are real bicycle angels, etc., and this is halfway printed. This would never ever be printed anymore. So no way. No, no, no way. So if you want to have this one done, it will. It would need to be in maiden or mandolin, depending on um, if you get them or not. Um, wow. Yes. So this is a very rare gimmick. Yeah. Yes. Look at this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, you did better, better moves than this one. <laughs> now, uh, this deck I brought uh, with me because I would like to explain you how this would work. In case you want to get your own business cards printed, etc., it doesn't make sense to print it only uh, on in one custom in in one deck. What we are doing is we are gathering um, jobs of different magicians. Maybe we have a packet trick for someone or uh, whatsoever. And we are collecting them into one complete deck of cards. This is, kind, uh, this is a deck of cards that exactly has this. Let me spread this to you. Then you would see that we have uh, cards like this that looks like um, a packet trick to me with gimmicks. Yes, that's the packet trick. Then comes a single card. Um, that was for Simon Aronson. I remember that one when uh, it was for a, a birthday trick. Then we had our uh, uh, Moza Monte gimmick that we needed. And, and here business cards, business cards, certainly with some other information of the SAM, etc. Uh, here later on we had our packet trick with the girls. What was here? Oh, a double, double face also that is uh, very interesting. Let's say if you want to have your own stand up Monty and want to give out your cards in case that would be uh, a, or, good, a good idea or for not us. business cards or you you like a stand up Monty with girls or with with and then then you would usually go for one it's only if you want to use two and a half thousand okay or if you're thinking of releasing a trick uh, and want to sell this in higher quantities to Murphy's or to another vendor then this might be the chance however I can tell you that this is not the the best idea usually if you don't have the connections uh, and try and you try to market your own effect. Uh, it's not that easy. That is uh, Sizzle, by the way. These are the cards that I pr that I used for Sizzle, and uh, so we have yeah. different back designs. Oh, this would be interesting yeah. because there's a new packet trick coming from um, Martin Breisers. That is really cool. Uh, this is the one that I have to show you later on. Uh, I hope you like it. Yes. So I think so. It's well, really, it's really cool. nice. Yes. So we have our Mona Lisa these, effect and so on and so cool. on. Yeah. Yes. So all this is in one printing sheet. And now the idea is that this deck exactly like this is printed two and a half thousand times plus minus 10% um, because a US okay. playing card can always, yeah, that's the, the, um, 
uh, what is it called? Uh, from Woody Aragon, but it's a trick, the original one, uh, the Protean card, mm -hmm. is it called, from uh, an effect of uh, Tamaris. Very interesting. Uh, twice the change. Now, cool. US playing card, when, they are, when, when I place an order of two and a half thousand decks or whatever, they always have that's for manipulation. Um, they always have the chance of um, printing less than 10%, up to 10% or up to 10% more. So everything needs to be um, um, taken from me in between 2,250 and 2,750 decks. So great, eh? Because it's a 10%. Yes, yeah, it's fun to to watch all these different cards, right? It's a lot of uh, yeah, creativity cool. that is yeah, in there. Yeah, absolutely. So and and as you can see, there's a lot of work in this. So we are not doing these decks every month. It always takes time so to to gather all the positions. Uh, the idea is that uh, when they are produced, uh, by the way, they cost um, um, one card that you want to get. Let's say you want to have your own uh, business card printed with a QR code on. Uh, you would get this card two and a half thousand times for three hundred three uh, thirty euros or dollars, depending on where Ma you live. Maximum. No. No. It's it's, uh, it's the middle. It's the middle. This thing. is exactly the for middle. two thousand five hundred cards. It might be that you would get two thousand seven hundred fifty cards. Then it would cost you two three three hundred and sixty three ten percent more. Hmm. Or if you would get less two thousand two hundred fifty cards, then you would uh, you would only pay. Two hundred ninety-five dollars. Wow. Oh, two hundred ninety-seven. Sorry. For a business card or for a gimmick, what do you what do you use all the time? And give away and give or away. destroy and so on and so yeah. on. You can do an impossible object like tearing it apart. Yeah. And, and it's all so, the really, yeah. really, really cool. So you stuff. can also print it like the half turn turn away like that. We I did this I for acrylic law, I think. No, no. What I mean is when you turn it into you turn it into this impossible object. Yeah. You turn ah, it okay. Yeah. I did this also one time. That's really, really interesting. Yeah. Cool. So or, yeah. Or like the like for for warp. Uh, the for warp. Yeah. Warp, yeah. That's when when so, uh, I did it there as well. well yes. You can do everything. Everything is possible. Uh, in Phoenix, anyhow, because uh, I am owning the copyright, so we have way more possibilities. With bicycle, I will tell you what is possible, what is not possible. If we have to evade this completely, um, definitely that's why I did the Phoenix design. I am completely allowed to do so many things. Now, how do we get from these decks with all the cards in there from all our customers to just two and a half thousand decks, uh, two and a half thousand cards of you? Well, it's about one week of Netflix and a lot of sorting. Thank you. Unfortunately, there are no machines already built. The only machine that I ever saw that does it was at Haynes House of Cards. Yeah. They are in Cincinnati, a very old uh, shop, very old lady. Um, and uh, this machine, unfortunately, was doing all the sorting for the bridge size Fox gimmicks. Back then, uh, the magicians were using bridge size cards and not poker cards. Poker, bicycle came later. So the whole machine is only able to sort the smaller, the, th uh, the, the, the narrower, uh, bridge size cards and therefore there was a lot of uh, uh, dust on the machine and was never used for many many years this, so this card is my favorite i love it yeah i did this at the beginning to as, as an advertisement card that we would print uh the cards to uh, three and a half i think there's even more information yeah, about the custom card Guck mal. we hadn't the link nochmal. okay yeah so uh <laughs> but doesn't matter we have something for you yes here if you want to uh, play around uh, with your own ideas or to see what is possible I created a link. Yeah, uh, Fox Lake definitely was uh, was the bomb. Everybody was using Fox Lake. What is, uh, by the way, the Aviator bridge size card, and then the Fox Lake was the the brand that was doing all the gimmicks, etc. And uh, Sean Fork was telling me a lot of the stories because I was not in Magic when they were still popular. Now, one more time, I will show you this uh, this um, link to it. Uh, I think that's this one here. So if you go to uh, our website um, slash car uh, QR slash custom, you will see an overview of all the different cards of, of trick cards, etc. When you click on them, they will turn around so that you can see back and f uh, backs and faces. And uh, yeah, that's uh, really um, the overview of if you want to get your cards printed on USB. Also good for mentalism when you want to have special cards where the people can write down and there is something printed. What did it? Use all, yeah, did it? Or did marked it. maybe marked cards. So 
in a certain way, yes. But most of the time, if you, let's say, you have a, a pet trick that, that you want to do over and over again, let's say you have your own one uh, one twist to fusion effect whatsoever with large index that is not available or you want to have your own values or you have your own um, tw uh, twist on the Mosa Monte and so on and so on and you need these cards in larger quantities maybe even branded then it's best to get onto the next printing job and I would uh, print those cards for you once they are done you will get the two and a half cool. thousand cards uh, sent over to you um, and we keep you informed. Right now we are finishing the preparation of the next um, printing sheet. So in case you are interested right now, uh, it would be a good time to contact me so that you might get onto the next printing sheet and don't have to wait too long. Yeah, that's, uh, that's true because yeah. we are uh, close to, yeah, to the target. <laughs> Yes, yes. Actually, we were uh, working together with, with Murphy's. We, 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 uh, sometimes we are working together with uh, several other producers who, is, who is finishing the next printing job. Yeah, good contact with Christian Grace in the moment for printing some special things. So We, are, we all work together because yeah. um, when, for instance, uh, it could be a Paul Harris effect or it could be Vanishing Ink, etc., etc., uh, we, we print that together and then sort them so that mm -hmm. we all supply you with the best cards however if I am if I have my fingers in the deal that's not always the case but if I'm always printing the highest quality and with six colors not the others not always mm. and most of the time actually not so and I want to provide the best quality that's why I'm going for um, six colors six colors because it is CMYK what means I can print photos like this cyan magenta uh, yellow go, and uh, black face. yes no I go face Look. oh okay oh, thank you so I can uh, do complete images however I also would need the okay dropped uh, no no problem um, we go on the top it's better for you okay so I can also print ha 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 I can print the red of the backs um, and the red on the faces because the the, the hearts and the diamonds um, have a very brilliant um, vibrant uh, red color that's a special Pantone red that cannot be mimicked by the CMYK. And I also print, I don't know, yeah, and I also print the blue um, uh, of the backs. And as this could be, for instance, a double backer in case you want this, or like the two, one twist to fusion where you yeah. have blue on both sides. Yeah, you printed for me, uh, it was a long time ago, these uh, special card wears double backer and there was um, uh, chocolate. On it. Yes. Yeah. However, we didn't go to the large quantity. Um, yeah, it was. Uh, it would be cool if we ever want to publish this as an effect. We might do it like this. However, we have two different problems. You, you never saw this trick, I think. Uh, with the plop, yeah? Uh, sure. Yeah. 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 Come on. Uh, well, he was using uh, a Ferrero. Ferrero Küsschen. Ferrero Küsschen. What is uh, <laughs> uh, similar, like the uh, Hershey kisses? Yeah. The Hershey kiss. Um, where you can uh, show the image of the of the uh, sweet, yeah, of the, the praline, uh, and then Cyril, it pops Cyril do something like that, I think. Okay. But when I when I come, it was a long time when we create this. Yeah. Um, I have no idea that uh, Cyril do also a similar trick like that. So it was yeah. a long time. Yes. In this time, I live in Ibiza, and I was all the time drunk. So, uh, and I have no idea who is, diff who is Cyril. Story. <laughs> different story. Yes. A different story. Um, yeah. There's a question, uh, Michael. Thanks for asking. Uh, is, is there any amount below 2,500 cards? Absolutely. For instance, you can. Uh, I mean, uh, the price for two and a half thousand cards is 330 euros. This includes VAT, this includes the, the, the tax and shipping over here, so we only have to ship from here to your home. Um, and if you only need, let's say, a thousand cards, then it gets um, still 330 euros, because we will throw away the rest of the cards. So it doesn't really make sense. It's still a very, very affordable price per card. Well, yeah, because when you print business cards, when I print business cards, I buy all the time 2,500, so... There is, there, well, uh, I, I mean, I was joking. In a, in a case, uh, um, let's say, even if you are looking for 500 gimmicks in a high quality that would match 100% uh, Phoenix deck, for instance, then I would definitely prefer doing it like this. Mm. However, if you, let's say, only need uh, a specific gimmick 50 or 100 times, then I would not do it like this. 
um, and I would custom print it in, in a one deck special one uh, deck and uh, you had this um, order prototype very uh, it's very here, near ah, it's here now this one here uh, looks like um, our Phoenix decks from USPC uh, the cardstock feels like that um, and um, with the deck switch it would perfectly uh, stay under the radar it handles nicely it even does ferro and so on and so on they will not last that long like our Phoenix USPC quality. So they wear out a tiny bit uh, faster. However, if you're buying yeah, those for bit. an event or so, yeah, uh, they are perfect bit. for this. Well, that was... Um, a it's a prototype. It's and it's also, there's, there's also some variations with it uh, that certainly can happen. Uh, let me show this to you. Now, if I compare this to our um, USPC cards, um, it looks in the camera it looks like a like black. black, black, yeah, black yeah, I know, I know. Yeah. Oh, so this the the, the to, to match the blue is very very difficult. I tried several times. That was a very dark version that I tried. Uh, the red as well. It, it's here. You have vibrant colors because Pantone vibrant is a totally different thing than mixing the cards together and seeing like you saw the Pantone color yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, today. Where's the box? I did he did he take it? Yeah, Whatever. For, for sure. For sure. <laughs> Still missing my Pantone color. Whoever got my Pantone fan, uh, please return it to me. I'm waiting for it. It's yeah. very uh, but another. This case. one was for or is for my uh, new release. It's a prototype and it, it it's perfect for. If you do around. if you do a deck switch, no magician, no layperson will ever notice that you just uh, switched a deck and now have a complete trick card, uh, the trick deck that is only existing once in the world. However, if you try to add this card um, with um, this, this, this red into um, a phoenix back, then you would notice there's something wrong. And therefore, I always will ask uh, in, which, in which circumstance um, you, do you want to print, uh, to, do you want to perform this effect? And maybe it's even a good idea of having one deck printed with only the gimmick so that you can give away 52 cards and one deck that is expensive because it's just a regular deck but it matches 100 percent the colors and therefore you can perform this trick with uh with with uh, very special printed cards one special deck that is a normal deck but matches the gimmicks so that you can work on this as well now the printing will be 35 euros or 35 dollars for a single deck um this uh, with oh you you removed it thank you so this is possible as well um, and these cards, because there's way more uh, work uh, necessary and for $35 it's, it's um, impossible to do, uh, there's a setup fee um, to get the cards uh, set up and the, de the deck set up and it's 20 euros uh, one time payment or $28 a one time payment and that's it. That covers uh, the, the, the cost and this also is much, much, much faster. Uh, and I th also think that's uh, very affordable uh, in both ways, especially in the quality we are we are searching for, because we only serve magicians. Sometimes I get a request from outside uh, for quartet gimmicks or whatsoever, but I always uh, prefer to say, um, if you want to get quality, I'm able to t tell you. If it's just uh, if it just needs to be cheap, uh, I can yeah refer you to other uh, other sources because I, I'm not for cheap, I'm just for quality and serving uh, the best quality for magicians. Um, so that, I mean, yeah, it's still affordable as you can see, Absolutely. it's just not cheap. Now, um, if you have any more questions or do you remember any, any others of the German well, stream? Uh, I think we are pretty, pretty yeah, much, uh, pretty much uh, through, uh, right? Yeah, 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 it's okay. Now, now the, the thing is that um, you wanted to prepare another <laughs> trick that you forgot last week. No, you, um, whatever, there was, I think, we can do all you and Liquid uh, were, you were, you were your, enemies, right? I have your wonderful effect. Um, you want to show this one? Is it the one? No, it's a prototype. Is it the one? This is, pro this is, this is, uh, aha, <laughs> uh -huh, but it's the old version. Um, Boys, um, how about this? Yeah. Uh, blank thought. Or this one here, espionage. No, we or did we, we did it last week. That's true. That's true. <laughs> you know, we can also cut short and get home quickly. Huh? Yeah. More, more quickly. 
No, I have to go my hair cuts, cuts to, tonight. Tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Full moon. <laughs> full, full, full moon, maybe. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> um, actually, that's it. If you have any more questions, please write them down here in the in the chat or next down week in we the show comments. you next next week we show a little bit of tricks and do something funny. But today uh, today we speak about cards and about what happened here and theory. It's a theory. Yeah. Same yes. Way. If you have any more questions uh, regarding the printing, I'm happy to help you. Um, I give you yeah more details, uh, formats, etc., etc. If you already have an idea for a deck, uh, let me know. That's really um, yeah. For me, it's a lot of fun. There are a lot of uh, different tools that we can use for printing uh, for for designing playing cards. Yeah. However, um, I have seen a lot of artwork that was not really good. And I did one gimmick uh, that was, I think, this vortex effect of Dan Harlan. Yeah. And he really, uh, he's a graphic artist. Yeah. Yes, the artwork that he provided was at that time not match, not working for the Pantone color because I wanted to make it in the six color, best, best quality. And mm. everything was just in CMYK. So it would not have fit into a bicycle of Phoenix. However, with all the information which switches I would have to do to get to the same result, including the Pantone color, I could copy exactly the result of his artwork because he told me, yeah, now you have to twist by so and so many percent with this filter and so on and so on. And we got exactly there where I needed to be. Uh, yeah, then I, I was surprised. Then Dan is a great graphic artist, cool. so he knows as well. Yes, yeah, so and he he's, so cre he's so creative and uh, he's awesome. Uh, absolutely, absolutely. So, and and a lot of fun hanging out with him so <laughs> definitely yeah that's cool yes that's cool. Um, is there a, a minimum age uh, we just get another question for the uh, from uh, from the chat thank you very much jack uh, will there be an a, a minimum age uh, for the Kartra college i think um, no and i think i mean if you, if we take the the kids of uh, sauce and victoria Where would you say, where's the limit? Yeah. These, these two kids were awesome already when they were still not adults. Now, you know, Sos uh, Junior as well, very good. And he is amazing. And I guess that uh, he could have told us a lot. Of first, tricks. first, I have to uh, have to paint uh, next weekend, uh, no, the coming, the upcoming weekend, uh, the, the college. <laughs> This, uh, I mean, we are preparing right now the uh, Kartra College. Um, it looks really, really great. Uh, and, and we did some of the first artwork. You will uh, see it because we will also do a little room tour on YouTube. Uh, and once it's, yeah. yes. So, and, and Alfred is already informed to do more on the doors, etc. Et yeah, that's cool. We will, we, will do, we will do something. And I think when it's ready, We will do a stream from there. Yes. This will be possible. And also we can change the locations right now. Then we have the studio. We have the college. Uh, also showroom. And yeah. I think that's already the... Let's let's see. I want to try something. This table here especially. Um, <laughs> if, you, if you would see... If you would see how this one looks uh, down here, because we needed to elevate it a little bit. However, this, this, this uh, table usually is way lower for conferences whatsoever or uh, trade shows. But it's better like this. And this is the perfect height for us magicians, etc. So um, I, I, I like this height. However, in the car truck school, I didn't want to have the elevation yeah. uh, in, in a way. With green boxes. Don't say anybody. It looks real. Nobody can see it because it's but, green screen. But the new one will be awesome. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So uh, we have, we have more, the, yeah, the whole design. No, no. no. Yeah. Uh, thanks to Richard, who is uh, helping me on, on this one. And cool. uh, yeah, the, the producer of the table is also helping me with the right print. Cool. So everything is now in the making. Yeah. Looking we have a lot of things to do in the future and we want to grow up and we want to do the live streaming more and more so also when the coronavirus is gone or when everything is fine we will stay here and you will be uh out for three days uh filming in uh, a theme park yeah exactly it's closed right now but we have the whole theme park for <laughs> yeah for, for, yeah, for our filming. for fun yes for so, fun. so so they, they have also theaters etc so that's uh the perfect setup uh there yeah we're filming also blank thoughts 
Yes, uh, blank audience. <laughs> no, one audience. There. Yeah, no, no one there. No one there. Nobody is there. Um, it's a shame. However, uh, next week we will be here again in one or two weeks. I hope that we will already be able to show you more about the new releases. Yeah. Uh, I'm working on those right now because voting is over. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for being here. And uh, again, um, last time. <laughs> Oh, yeah, subscribe please. us help yeah. us grow this, this channel is still uh, new uh, so there are not so many subscribers and viewers and i try to uh, really get this um, to a much higher level and just english so we separated the two channels yeah. that works uh, good so far but this one needs more attention so please subscribe if you have not done yet and uh, what's going on here bama thought there was some fun behind acme behind uh, it's an insider, I think. That that is definitely an insider, <laughs> and we will help you on this one next time. So thank you so much for being with us. Thank you, Christian, for all this great informations. When you have informations, write out an email. Uh, by the way, if you ever wanted to find out what Acme means, or which company is behind Acme, mm -hmm. Google it. It's it's such a funny Wikipedia entry about Acme because it was uh, first coming out with Bugs Bunny, etc. The whole uh, okay. Lo Looney Tunes thing. And you really want to read this. It's fun. Cool. Yes. Guys, we will see us in a week. Thanks so much for joining us. And um, yeah. Oh, American company that manufactures everything. That's an <laughs> egg me. Isn't this cool? That's cool. Man. <laughs> it's yeah, really cool. awesome. Guys, we will see us next week. Thank you so much. And uh, have fun. Stay healthy. Until then. Bye-bye.